what's going on guys all right i want to do this differently but uh my computer caught a virus so it's redoing its thing right now so i decided to send this up real quick on my iphone uh about this is it michael jackson is this is it if you guys are true michael jackson fans this is the movie you need to go check out uh i can't tell you how electric it was man it was just like mike was there um seeing him in this never before seen footage of him actually commanding the band doing his thing this is a side of michael that we've never ever seen before you know, a lot of people say that michael jackson is too timid and he didn't really call his own shots and everybody did his own thing if you see this movie you're gonna know that that's far from the truth everything you've ever seen in a michael jackson performance has always been orchestrated by him um even some new stuff man i mean they did some new I don't want to give everything away because I know a lot of you watching this is going to go out and see this. But what I really want to convey is if you are a true Michael Jackson fan or ever been curious about Michael Jackson at all, this is the movie you need to see. We get to see the behind the scenes of the man himself doing his thing with all of these dancers that he that, that he actually, they're new dancers because he got them all um, from auditions just for This Is It. You know, a lot of critics said Mike wasn't going to do all 50 concerts, that he was old, that uh, they thought he was milking it. Man, let me tell you this. This was like a two and a half hour movie, and Michael Jackson was moving from the time the movie started to the time the movie ended. It never seemed like the guy got tired at all. And I know that this was footage of taken between April and I think July, but if you see him working, it's like he never got tired, even from one sequence to the next to the next. He was in rare form, and this was going to truly be one outstanding concert that the saddest thing for me is that now all of us who are fans and wanted to see this is not going to truly get to see the production that he put together. Like I said, I want to give everything away, but I mean, I'll just say this. There's some new 3D animations that he had for this. Uh, all, all the songs that he was doing... Are older songs because he didn't really write any new songs except for the this is it album but these are songs that he said his fans wanted to hear so all the songs that a lot of us who grew up might grew up with you know beat it billy jean want to be starting something all the way down to they don't care about us you know all of those um he was bringing back in this concert for his fans um Talent, I just can't describe to you the talent of the people that, that he was working with on this. And the, the cool thing for me was that as he was doing his thing, you know, the dancers on the look at him, and they were just like the biggest fans in the world, man. They were jumping down, cheering, doing their thing. Um, so if this is a movie you guys are going to go see, I think you should go check this out. I know it starts uh, now today, which is the 28th. I got in uh, to see a preview on the 27th. Me and my best friend Nick went to see it. My wife couldn't go because she was pregnant, couldn't stand that long. So we're going to definitely be picking this up on DVD and Blu-ray. Uh, I hope I answered all the questions that you guys wanted me to answer with This Is It. But it is a phenomenal show. Go check it out. Go pick up the disc. Eleven ninety nine right now at Target and Best Buy. This Is It 2 disc, uh, two CD set with a 32-page color book. Can't say enough about it. Uh, I hope Mike rest in peace. He gave his fans a, a tremendous lot of things. Um, and, and this movie, I think we all needed to see is going to bring some closure for some of us. Um, but I think this truly shows what an epic man that Michael was. So Michael Jackson, rest in peace. You guys check out the movie. Catch you guys next time.